Hello and welcome to the market update for 2017. My name's Charlie Bello and I'm pleased to present to you some of the latest stats of what's been happening in the last 12 months. Between 2016 and the 2017 financial year, the WA's GDP declined 2.7%, primarily off the back of the end of the mining sector's construction boom. However, there is positivity for rebound in the WA economy. After a recent survey by WA Super reporting 50% of businesses are expecting to keep their work workforce steady, while 23% anticipate the need to hire extra staff which is a great sign for growth in the WA economy. The future for Canning is looking strong. We've got the Westfield Carousel, which is currently under construction. Looks like it's going to be finished by the end of 2018, um, which is a great $350 million project. We've also got the City Centre, which is a 10-year plan, which boosts, bolsters some great interest in the area. And we've got all these new retail shops, including Audi. So the surrounding suburbs are really going to benefit in the long term off the back of these new projects. We'll now go through, through some market stats in the Cannington area. Cannington's median house price is currently sitting at $445,000, which is up 2.9% from last year. The number of transactions is 152, which is up from 12 last year as well. East Cannington is currently sitting at 477,500, which is down 8.2% from last year. And there's been 99 transactions in the past 12 months, which is down 29 from last year. Yep. Queens Park's median house price is $425,000, which is down 9% from 2016. And there's been 157 transactions, which is down 27 transactions from last year. Beckenham's median house price is 415,000, which is down 7.1%. 7 and the number of transactions that have happened in the past 12 months are 178, which is down 50 from the year before. Wilson's median house price is 520,000, which is down 5.9% from last year. And there's been 110 sales in the suburb, which is down six from the year before. My experience with the 2017 market is that we've seen a balanced market this year. We've seen consumer confidence pick up towards the second half of the year, off the back of the great buying opportunities, the strengthening of the WA economy, and the low interest rates. Um, and we've seen buyers really recognise that there's some excellent buyers out there over the past 12 months. If you'd like a sales suburb report on the last 12 months of sales history in your suburb, or if you'd like a market appraisal on the value of your property, please get in touch with me. We'd love to help you out. Uh, have a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year and I look forward to seeing you in 2018.